Welcome back to Andy the Lab. This week, we're lab testing the 2019 Nissan Murano. Exterior color, deep blue pearl paint. Rear privacy blacked out windows. 20 inch dark silver wheels. Panoramic moon roof. Want a race key? Remote start. <laughs> and you gotta love an automatic tailgate. This is the Platinum All Wheel Drive, a fully loaded model. So let's check out the rear special carpet. You have a Murano area rug back here. Look at this thing. It's thick, it's plush. You can probably use it in your house. And underneath, it's lined with rubber, so it's not gonna slip. And it was really easy to vacuum. Underneath the carpet, you have, da -da, ooh. You have a spare tire plus some extra spots to tuck away storage. I also love that the sides are a two-tone color and in this model it happens to match Andy. Her dog hair is hidden but overall I think the carpet is a better quality. Great when you have a fur kid and when you need the extra space those second row seats they go fully flat and you can do it from the rear. Honestly, this is such a great size vehicle for a large fur kid like Andy. Seats up, seats down, one up, one down, doesn't matter. Andy fits back here great, and I'm pretty sure she likes it. But look, I'm not trying to sound like an infomercial here, but it only gets better. You have to check out the beauty of this leather. Ooh, yeah. Honestly, it feels like you're inside an infinity. That's how nice these seats are. The quilting, stitching, piping, these are so thick and soft. What is going on in here? 10-way power adjusting seat. Does anyone drive this close? Lumbar support, heated, ventilated, and it has memory settings. The name of these seats are cashmere, and I love how it matches Andy. Honestly, if you think Infinity is a little hoity-toity, this is why you get the Platinum Edition in this Nissan. Wood grain looking trim with some softish features on the front. Infotainment, you have an eight inch color display. Now there's a lot going on in here, but Nissan now has smartphone integration. So I've been using Apple CarPlay and I also love that it has an updated USB-C connection. And if you don't want to connect your phone, but you still want to access your playlist, you can stream your music via Bluetooth. Even though this vehicle seems to have all the bells and whistles, it does not have a wireless charger or that tent, huh? but that's a different story. A wireless charger is an option in the center console. If you're seriously considering a Murano, I would highly recommend you add that to your package. Now, climate control is easy to access with knobs, storage, center console, front console, doors, rubberized tray, and two extra cup holders, and more. Andy, how you doing back there? Let's go check out that second row. As you can see, you have a 60-40 split back here. Andy, let me show them. Go back to your bed. Seats don't move forward, but they recline back. And this armrest, look how thick this is. Dang, that thing is thick. You want to raise cake? It's right here. It's right here. Ow. Tons of space. I think you can definitely fit three adults back here. Leg room is great and the floor is basically flat. Heated seats back here, two extra vents, and I love how there's an additional USB-C and USB port. Storage, you got seat backs, doors, and this cute little dog treat holder up front. Oh, and I totally forgot the ambient lighting. There's lighting up front 
but also back here. I feel like I normally see that in more luxury vehicles. Pretty sweet. Look, Andy. Ah, what's that? <laughs> you match the cashmere. You're so beautiful. Let's go get this Murano on the road. This drives so smoothly and I feel like it's well insulated because there's really not a lot of road noise. I'm honestly really impressed. And this has a 3.5 liter V6 engine, 260 horsepower and 240 pound-feet of torque. It does take a little bit longer to get this CVT up to speed, but honestly, very comfortable to drive. Now, the steering wheel feels nice, but I think it feels a bit tight. Not necessarily a bad thing, I just find I have to use a little muscle here and there to get this thing to move. But check this out, telescoping wheel, that is nice. The gas tank also seems massive. I got this dropped off on a full tank and it read it had almost 600 miles. It's got all the great safety features in place. Even when you leave the vehicle, it notifies you to check the rear to make sure no one's in the back. And it really doesn't like it if you forget your seatbelt. And at nighttime, these exterior lights are nice and bright great visibility and for spotting some of Andy's dear friends. I've heard a lot of people say the infotainment in the Murano is kind of outdated, but now that it has smartphone integration, you could just plug in your phone and boom, Aunt Siri and Uncle Waze is there to help. That is a game changer. And the screen is also bright, so it really doesn't feel antiquated and it's very responsive to touch. Your instrument cluster, you can see a bunch of information like what road you're on, the direction you're traveling, fuel economy, the speed limit, but I also really like that it displays your music. So you could have your navigation on the touch screen but still see what music is playing right up front. If you're familiar with some of our past videos, we've had a chance to review a lot of Infinities. This is our first Nissan and I am completely blown away. Totally fur kid friendly. I love how comfortable Andy is back there, especially when I pop this moonroof open and her ears are flapping in the wind. dog scussing and our top five favorite features are one the seats pretty obvious by now but these are seriously luxe two smartphone integration it really elevates the infotainment setup three the overall quiet interior space four this spacious rear even with the second row seat up i can get her bed vertically so i have all this extra space on the side and five, I love the light colored carpet on the sides. Much harder to see dog hair back here. Big shout out to Nissan for letting us lab test this 2019 Murano. You're the boss. Oh, it is totally lab approved. She did not even have to think about that one. Don't forget, subscribe to our channel. And if you click that bell, you'll know when our next lab tested review is up. Should we say goodbye? Give me your paw. We'll see you next time. Bye. Shoo!